at where I'm at. I'm at a super center. But look at what it is. It's a delicious apple. I wonder how this apple got here. Every apple at the grocery store came from an apple field. First, you gotta pick the perfect fruit. Like this one. This one looks really tasty. And after you pick it, you put it inside the bin with all the other apples. <laughs> Let's try and find an apple together. Hmm, do you see an apple? Ah, I see one! Yeah, look! <laughs> Yum! <laughs> it all starts by a worker handpicking every single apple. And then, they dump their sack into the bins. And when the bin gets full, a tractor picks it up and takes it away. The apples are all out of the fields and into the bins, and the bins are full. Now we need to transport them to the trucks. Wow, four giant bins full of apples. And one red tractor. Okay, the apples are now here at the semi truck. Now we gotta load up all the bins on top of the back of the semi-truck with a forklift. are loaded on the back of the truck, so let's go! Off to the factory we go. We've arrived at the factory. So now we need to take a forklift and get every single bin off the back of the semi-truck. It is time to clean and package all of the apples. <laughs> Look, green apples. Now we need to empty the bins of all of the apples so we can clean them and package them. The apples start their floating journey while the bins get emptied out. Look, the bins are empty. Whoa, that's a lot of floating apples. Then they get taken out of the water 
and scrubby dub dub, <laughs> nice and clean. And clean some more. Look at all those bristles. Those apples look like they're having fun. <laughs> and then all the apples get sprayed with some water. Nice and clean. And then they go through giant fans. Once the apples are all dry, they get sorted. They get sorted by the ones that look really tasty to eat and ones <laughs> that don't look tasty to eat. And remember the not so tasty looking apples? Yeah, these are them. They get to go up some fun apple escalators, and then they get to go down some radical apple conveyor belts on their journey to make some tasty apple pie. But we're not done there yet. Every tasty looking apple gets a sticker. This is the sticker machine. And once every single apple has its very own sticker, they get put on what I like to call apple beds. <laughs> and then the next step is that those apple beds get put inside of cardboard boxes. And some get put inside plastic bags. Looks like some of these boxes need their tops closed. Now that the apples are all clean and packaged up, we got a storm in a giant refrigerator and wait for the trucks. <laughs> We're inside the giant refrigerator now. It is very cold in here. This is where all of the apples get stored. Wow! Look at how many apples there are! That's a really tall storage building. Yippee! The semi-truck is backing up to the building so it can be loaded up with a bunch of fresh apples.
All right, Farklefts, just a little bit more apples. Now that the semi truck is all full of apples, it's gonna deliver them to the grocery stores. Ooh, it was sure fun seeing how apples get to the grocery store with you. And remember, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. I'm at a toy store. Whoa, so many toys. I think we should check out some toys and learn the colors of these toys, like this one. Wow, look at these colorful balls. There's blue, green, red, yellow, and purple. Whoa, wow, I love this toy store. Ooh, there's some puzzles. Whoa, and some of my favorite, a tractor toy, and it's the color green. Whoa, green, 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 green. Ooh, and another tractor, but this tractor is black. Whoa, green, 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 green. Even more toys. <gasps> like this bulldozer, which is the color yellow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, and a giant scooper over here. Oh, let's put that back and get this scooper. Whoa. <laughs> this scooper is the color green and blue. <laughs> oh and orange wheels. I didn't see that. Hey, what else do we have here? <laughs> Whoa, an off-road vehicle. Wow, this off-road vehicle is the color yellow. Okay, let's put this off-road vehicle back and check out some more toys. Mm. Ooh, look at this one. This car is the color blue. Bing, 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 bing. <laughs> Whoa, and we got some animals right here, like the cow, Moo. which is black and white. And then, uh, ooh, a pretty brown horse. A cute white dog. Okay, let's put the dog back. And let's head on down the toy aisle some more. Hmm. <laughs> Whoa! A really big monster truck! Wow! Here we go. This monster truck is the color green, purple, black, and there's a little bit of red up there. Wow. Okay, what else do we have? Ooh, a really big monster truck again. <laughs> this monster truck is the color red. Wow. Okay. I think we have seen enough toys at the to <laughs> Wait a second. We can't forget about this bright orange toy. Whoa, ooh, orange. Okay, now I think we're good to go on the toy store. Learning cup, <laughs> wait a second. You gotta check these out back here. <gasps> Last toys. 
dump trucks. Yeah, they're the color yellow. Whoa, and another bulldozer, which is also the color yellow. All right, well, those are all the construction vehicles right here that are the color yellow. Well, see you later. Bye. Come on everyone, let's make learning fun So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout Blippi! Oh, this toy's the color pink <laughs> Ooh. Oh hey, there's some more toys Like this one, this one's the color pink Oh, and this one, this one's the color pink <laughs> Oh yeah, this one too, this one's the color pink Oh, oh, look at this playset this place sets the color pink. And whoo, a stuffed animal, which is the color pink. It's me, Blippi, and today we're gonna learn about sports cars. on your seat belt in a sports car. All right, huh. we have to shut the door. Wow, what an interesting door. <laughs> Ooh, look at this car. The inside of this car is the color black. Ooh, whoa, what's this in my hand? Huh, this is a steering wheel and can you think of any other vehicles with steering wheels? Yeah, a tractor has a steering wheel. Ooh, a monster truck has a steering wheel. Ooh, even a go-kart has a steering wheel. <laughs> a backhoe has a steering wheel. And even a ship has a steering wheel. <laughs> That's funny. Ooh, look at this. This is a navigation system, so then you know where you're going when you're driving the sports car. <laughs> See these? These are paddle shifters. This is how you shift the car. Now let's learn the exterior parts of the blue sports car. Come on! Ooh, look at this. Wow! A big wheel and tire. It is so big. Look at it. It's like that big. Wow, do you see the blue brake? I heard these cars go so fast. It's a really big brake to slow down the car. Look! Wow! <laughs> it's such a pretty blue color. Look at it. Huh, I love the color blue. Just like my shirt, my hat, and my shoes. Whoa! <laughs> Ooh, look up here. Ooh, how the car gets all of its power is the engine. Let me pop the hood. Look at that! The door just opened up vertically. That is so crazy. Okay, let me pop the hood. All right, now for the engine. Whoa. Huh, wait a second. There's nothing in here. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, I know. The engine on the sports car is in the back. All right. Whoa. 
that is a massive engine. This has a V12. <laughs> that is really powerful. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ooh, look at this. Whoa, this is the exhaust. There's one big exhaust right here. This is where the exhaust goes out from the engine. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Do you see this? This is where you put the gas inside this car. Ooh. And down here, that's where air goes in to cool down the car. That is so cool. <laughs> oh, hey, look. <laughs> There's a baby seat in there. <laughs> That's silly. Ooh. And last but not least. Ooh. Headlights. Wow. It looks like there's two headlights. One. Two. <laughs> wow. <laughs> learning about sports cars with you. I want to give a special shout out to Sven. <laughs> Thank you so much, Sven, for making this video possible. He is so cool. <laughs> Wait, bye-bye. But since we're at the beach, I'm going to go swimming, okay? <laughs>
Whoa! The second load! <laughs> yeah! Okay, one last load. Which is the third load? One, two, three! Yeah, look at that big load! Whoa! And look at what it is! Oh, 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 we got it! Yeah! The snowmobile! Woohoo! Good job, excavator! Yeah! Excavator did a really good job! <laughs> and good job, dump truck! Okay! Now the snowmobile can play in peace! <laughs> Today, we're going on a great green adventure. It's going to be so much fun. And along the way, we're going to be on the lookout for some special puzzle pieces that will help us learn about a few things we can do to help keep our Earth super healthy. Come on, let's go! Hey, it's me, Blippi. Wow, and look at where I'm at. Yeah, today I'm at Priest Point Park in Olympia, Washington. Whoa, and look at this place. Wow, there's some moss on this giant tree. Oh, look, here's some shrubs. Yeah, this is actually a fern. Wow, in this video, we are going to learn about keeping our planet happy and healthy. Woohoo! Wow, it's raining. <laughs> I love the rain. Wow, have you ever danced in the rain before? Woo! It's so fun! <laughs> yeah, our planet has so many different climates. And right now, I'm in a rainy forest! Wow, this is so cool! Oh, it's really pouring now! <laughs> Makes me so happy! Woo! Oh jeez, I love being in nature. Wow, it's such a great place to be. <laughs> Whoa, look at this massive tree. Whoa, it's bark. Feels so cool on my hands. Whoa, it's so textured. Whoa, that's really cool. Wow, I love plants. Trees, shrubs, flowers. <laughs> yeah, there's so many great plants because they provide us oxygen. Yeah, and other things like vegetables, fruit. <laughs> but it's not all about us enjoying nature. We need to give back as well. Yeah, have you ever planted a plant before? <laughs> yeah, it is so much fun. Digging in the dirt, planting the plant, watching it grow. <laughs> oh, <gasps> what is this? Do you see what I see? Yeah, this is a puzzle piece. Whoa, check it out. I love puzzles. <laughs> huh, look at it. I wonder if there's more puzzle pieces around here. Will you help me look? Hey, it's our first puzzle piece on a great green adventure. And our first step in learning how to keep the earth healthy. Step number one, is to clean up. Cleaning up helps get rid of pollution. 
Pollution is when you make the land, water, or air dirty. So by cleaning up, we're getting rid of pollution. And that's good for our Earth. <laughs> yeah! Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo! The Blippi Cleanup Crew is here to party! Woo! <laughs> yeah, I'm so excited to make sure this place is nice, clean, and tidy. Yeah, it's really good for our planet to make sure that it's clean and tidy. All right, first thing we need is our cleanup gloves. And there is the first glove. And here is our second glove. Hey, what color are these? Yeah, the color blue. <laughs> Woo! All right, let's see if we can find some trash. Hmm, let's see. Looks like a bunch of leaves and grass yeah, and soil. That's all good. <laughs> all right. Hmm, do you see any? I'm not seeing any. Oh, you see some? Oh, down there? Oh, yeah, we found some trash. Well, when this is here and it's not supposed to be here, it's called littering, and littering is bad. And that makes me angry. But you and I are here to help. All right, first let's pick it up yeah, and put it in here. But do you know what this is? Yeah, this is paper. And paper, we can actually recycle it. <laughs> that means that we'll be able to reuse it later. <laughs> All right, see if we can find some more. Oh, you see some more? Oh, down here? Wow! Good find! Uh, it should not be here though. <laughs> but like I said, you and I are here to help. All right, let's see. What is this? Is it a musical instrument? <laughs> yep, it's a musical instrument. And it was also litter. But hey, we can actually use this for later, and that's called recycling. And this can will be able to recycle. Good job! <laughs> found another piece. Wow! Good job. We are doing such great work today. Whoa! And this is a plastic bottle. Oh, I wonder what was in here at one time. Who knows? <laughs> We're too busy. Gonna recycle this. Another thing to recycle. Yeah, we have found so many things in this park that we can recycle. Yep, and reuse. <laughs> and this. <laughs> this is a glass bottle. Yeah, glass is also recyclable. So let's put it in the bag <laughs> and use it for later. Yeah, and you know what this is? <laughs> A really loud plastic water bottle. <laughs> and water bottles that are plastic, you can recycle. Here we go. <laughs> Did you hear that? <gasps> I stepped on an aluminum can. <laughs> an aluminum you can recycle. <laughs> so let's put it in here and let's recycle. Come on. Wow, check it out. Wow, four bins to put all the litter that we found. Yeah, into them so then we can recycle. All right, let's see what they read. 
This one says can. C-A-N. Can. <laughs> this one says plastic. P-L-A-S-T-I-C. Plastic. Glass. G L A S S. Glass. And last but not least, paper. P A P E R. Paper. Okay, now we need to take all the items that we just found and sort them so then they can be recycled. <laughs> all right, let's see. The first item that we found. Oh yeah! You remember what this is? Let's see, which one do you think it goes in? Cans? No. Plastic? No. Glass? No. Yeah! This is paper! Yeah! There you go! <laughs> All right, what else do we have in here? Let's close our eyes. Oh, yeah! woo -hoo! The plastic water bottle! <laughs> All right, which one of these is for plastic? Hmm, let's see. Oh, yeah! Plastic! <laughs> All right. Here we go. Let's close our eyes. Wow, remember this? Yeah, the musical instrument. <laughs> All right, enough playing around. We need to clean up our planet. All right, what is this? Is it a can, plastic, glass, or paper? Yeah, it's a can. <laughs> All right, just a few more things. Whoa, check this out. Yeah, this clear bottle, it's really hard. Wow, I can't crush it, but it's pretty delicate. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is glass. All right, here we go. Yeah! We finished the first step on our great green adventure. Nice job cleaning up all that litter and recycling. Remember, recycling is when we take paper, plastic, glass, and cans and allow them to be turned into something else instead of thrown away. An easy thing we did to make the world a better place. All right, what else is in here? Look at what we found! Another puzzle piece! Whoa! Good job! We are doing so great today. Hey, what's on it? Hmm. Yeah! This is an electric car! Another piece of the Great Green Adventure Puzzle! Woohoo! Step number two. Let's check out an electric car! Electric cars are super cool because they run on electricity instead of gas. And that's great for our Earth! But before we do that, let's learn a little more about respecting our planet Earth. Because it's our home! Look at the plants, look at the trees, all the beautiful colors, all the gorgeous leaves. Our Earth is green, our Earth is blue. Protect its goodness for me and you Our earth is rare and we only get one Let's help it along Come on, it's fun! Respect the trees, they give us lots of air Respect the creatures, give them lots of care Respect the plants, cause they help us all to breathe Respect the water, the oceans and seas When we make it is out here oh <laughs> whoa check it out do you see what this is yeah 
This is a red and white vehicle. <laughs> Looks like a small car or a truck. <laughs> and today, you and I are gonna meet someone really cool. That's Dave over there, and he is awesome. He did something awesome. He took a gas-powered vehicle and converted it to run on electricity. <laughs> I am so excited to meet Dave and check out his cool vehicle. Let's go. Wow, check it out. This little logo says E-V. Yeah, the two letters E-V stand for electric vehicle. Whoa, and these, <laughs> these little speakers, yeah, these are the horn. <laughs> That's awesome. Wow, what a cool vehicle. Oh, hello. Wow, what a great interior. <laughs> oh, hey Dave, how are you? Hi, Felicity, how are you? Oh, good, thank you for showing us your cool vehicle. What's this? That's the battery. It's actually 48 batteries all connected together with these copper bars. Wow, you said it's 48 batteries all 48 connected? connected into one big battery. Wow. Hey, have you ever named this vehicle before? Yeah, it's all Sparky. Oh, Sparky? Hey, yeah, this is this vehicle's name. Oh, Sparky. O-S-P-A-R-K-Y. Oh, oh, Sparky. Is that because it runs on electricity? Yeah. <laughs> That's a cool name. Hey, if this is the battery, where's the motor at? The motor's up front. You want to see it? Yeah. All right. Wow! Whoa! Check it out! This is the motor of O Sparky. Can you tell us what all this stuff is? Well, this is a real big motor. And this is the this is what brings the power from the battery to the motor. And this is the brains that tells this how much power the motor needs. Wow! That is really cool. Hey! Can I drive O Sparky today? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah! Wow, check it out. Yeah, this is the charging cord of O Sparky. All right, there we go. <laughs> yeah, you know how gasoline vehicles have a little airy to fill it up with gasoline? Not this one. This one has a cable. Wow. And then this is how you charge the batteries. So first, you have to plug it in, just like that. And then you let it sit. <laughs> in the meantime, let's check out the vehicle. Whoa, look at this. Yeah, flames. <laughs> wow. These flames are the color red. Yeah, just like this. Hey, and what color is this? White. Whoa, and look down here. Oh, some cute wheels and tires. <laughs> what color is the rubber on this tire? Yeah, it's the color black. And the wheel is white. And the lug nuts are red. Wow. Hey, and a little mirror right here. Hello. Hey. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. And then we saw this earlier. This is where the batteries of O Sparky are. Wow. And this is actually wood. Whoa. <laughs> well, I think we should hop on the inside and check it out.
Let's check out the inside of the super rad vehicle. <laughs> All right, first things first. Yeah, safety first. That's why I'm gonna put on my seatbelt. There we go, tighten it up. Perfect. All right, check this out. This is the steering wheel. And in the center of the steering wheel, we have the horn. Listen. <laughs> so silly. All right, down here we have some foot pedals. This, yeah, that is the throttle. This is the brake. And the left one is the clutch. But you don't use that in this vehicle. <laughs> All right, and right here, this is the parking brake. Okay, here we go. Whoa, do you see how I'm moving? Whoa, okay, I put my foot on the brake because as soon as I released this and didn't have my foot down there, then we started to roll. <laughs> okay, this is how you go forward. And that is how you go backward. Whoa, <laughs> that is really cool. And then, just like a normal vehicle, we have a key down here. Wow. And this is to change the gears. There's only two gears in this vehicle. <laughs> wow, this is such a really cool vehicle. We finished step number two on our great green adventure. That electric car is good for the environment and definitely helps with pollution. <laughs> hey, that was fun. Whoa, what was that? Whoa, yeah, a puzzle piece. Whoa, and this puzzle piece has seeds on it. Whoa, <laughs> good job. <laughs> Let's add it to our great green adventure puzzle. Step number three on our adventure, let's learn about seeds and plants. Did you know that plants come from little itty bitty baby seeds? Yeah, <laughs> that's right. Then they grow into big and tall plants that help make the oxygen we breathe. <sighs> so plants are really important to a healthy earth. Let's go check some out. nursery in Seattle, Washington. And this place is so awesome. There are so many plants here and plants are great for our planet. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Whoa, this is a clay pot. Whoa, that's a really big pot. And this is what you can plant some plants in. Hello. <laughs> All right, put that back right there. Let's go! Wow! I love all these plants. They're so colorful. Hey, what color is this plant? Yeah, it's the color green. Whoa! Hey, and check out this. This is a flower. Do you see what color that flower is? Yeah, it's kind of like a pinkish, light purple. Let's just call it pink with white. Oh, so pretty. <laughs> wow. Whoa, look at all of these. I love plants because they bring so much great oxygen to our planet. Oh, hey, these are edible plants. That means you can eat them. <laughs> Yum. <laughs> There's a lot of herbs here like this. Check it out. That's parsley. Yeah, you've probably had that in some of your food before. And then some cilantro. Oh, looks like a little animal ate some last night. <laughs> wow. Oh, and look at that. Looks like we have some mint. Mm. Ooh, 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 ooh. Smells minty fresh. <laughs> hey. Wow. Looks like we have some vines. Vines are cool because they grow up. Yeah, and around, and they grab onto things. Wow, look at it. You see how tall this plant is? It's because it's wrapping itself around these pieces of wood. That is really cool. <laughs> what a smart plant. 
Looks like we have some sweet box. Sweet box. Yeah, sweet box is a great plant for hummingbirds. They love to eat this plant. Yeah, well, the nectar at least. <laughs> and did you know hummingbirds can flap their wings so fast? Oh, look, there's a person. Hey. Hi. Who are you? My name's Katie. Oh, nice what? to meet you, Katie. Yeah. I'm Flippy. I what, do what are these? These are evergreen trees. Whoa. That means they keep their leaves or needles all year long. Wow. What lucky trees. Well, hey, I have a question. Do you know any place around here that I can plant some plants? I do. Follow me. All right. Here you go, Flippy. Here's a great place to plant some plants. Cool, awesome. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, <laughs> do you know what you're doing? Yep, I think I got it. Thank All you. Right. <laughs> Have fun. See ya. Wow, I am so excited. Okay, so it looks like we have all the things that we need to plant some plants. Looks like we have a lot of soil. Whoa! Whee! <laughs> yeah, and this soil is packed full of organic nutrients. Whee! <laughs> Whoa, soil is so fun! I love adding water and then it gets all muddy and it's so fun to splash and play in. But today, we're planting plants. <laughs> okay, and then we have a little container. Yeah! And then what we need to do is put some soil in the container. And then after we put the seeds, oh, there they are, the seeds in the soil, then we water them and then sun goes on it and then the plants will grow. Okay, so let's do that now. First, let's put on our gloves. One glove on, two gloves on, so now I won't get dirty. <laughs> All right, put that over there. <laughs> All right, let's take our container and fill it up with soil. There we go, three scoops filled up this container. All right, so now let's Pack it down just slightly. There we go. Actually, let's add a little bit more. All right. So now what we're gonna do are take these seeds and put them in the holes that we poke in there, okay? But for this, I'm gonna use my hand. So let's poke one hole, huh. two hole, three holes. There we go, perfect. And now, check this out. These seeds are so small. You see how small those are? Wow, it is so crazy to think that these little seeds will grow into plants. There we go. Now, let's cover up the holes. Perfect. Now that there's seeds in there, covered up nice and gently, now we get to water it. Wow, perfect. <laughs> Whoa. Now, have you ever wondered what seeds we just planted? Yeah, I didn't tell you, did I? <laughs> yeah, we actually planted lavender seeds. Oh. Hey, check it out. And when those seeds grow up to get bigger, this is what they're gonna look like. This is a lavender plant. Whoa, smells so good, you can eat it. And when it's spring and summertime, it blooms into a beautiful plant like this. Whoa, I am so excited. Hey, good job. <laughs> Step number three on our great green adventure, check. Our little plant will give the world some much needed oxygen that we breathe every day. <sighs> Great job! Woohoo! That was so much fun planting those seeds! <laughs> well, hey, I think we should find some plants that we could go plant in the wilderness and then we'll make our earth even prettier! <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh, hey! This area is called the native plant 
plants area. Yeah, all of these plants are perfect for planting around here. Yeah, which are plants that are native to where we're at right now. Wow, these look so cute. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, the last puzzle piece. This is a picture of the sun. This is awesome. This is the last thing that we need in order for all these plants to grow big and healthy. Water, soil, and sun. The final piece of our great green adventure puzzle. Awesome. Step number four on our adventure is learning how to help our plants grow. By giving our plants room to grow, their roots can spread and get even bigger. With the right amount of soil, water, and sunlight, they'll grow up and get nice and strong. Happy, healthy plants will make for a happy, healthy earth. Let's grab one of these. Hey, this looks pretty perfect. This is a fern. Wow, this fern is great. Whoa, 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 check this out. Yeah, my two favorite colors. A blue flower. Oh, and that's kind of orange. Whoa, I think we should totally take these as well and plant them. <laughs> yeah, good job. Right here on Earth, we have all we need. Our friend, our home, we plant the seed. From the air we breathe, to the water we drink, to the land we live on, really makes you think. From the mountains high, to way down below, we all share the earth, now it's time you know. Respect the trees, they give us lots of air. Respect the creatures, give them lots of care. Respect the plants, cause they help us all to breathe. Respect the water, the oceans and seas. When we make a change, we'll see the worth. We all have to help and respect our earth. Whoa, that was a big hill. And what I'm doing is taking all of these items up to the top of the hill so then we can plant the plants. <laughs> Let's check out what I brought up here. Yep, I brought my gardening gloves. <laughs> Looks like I brought my big shovel. Yeah, so we can dig in the dirt. So then we can put our plant that we brought from the nursery into the hole. And this is a fern. And this fern is native to this area. So it's gonna thrive in this environment. <laughs> a little hand shovel, whoa, and then the two cute flowers, so cute. <laughs> oh, can't forget about the wheelbarrow, wow, hey, and some water, yes, yeah, so we can plant, Ooh. so we can water the plant after we plant it. Oh, and last but not least, yeah, Mulch, whoa, check it out. Mulch is actually just chopped up pieces of bark. Yeah, check that out. Bark and wood and plants. Yeah, it actually provides nutrients to the soil. And also, it helps make sure the soil maintains its moisture. <laughs> okay, let's get to planting. Whoa, 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 check it out. Do you see this tree? Oh, what a cute little tree this is. <laughs> hey tree, how are you? Thank you for being you. But hey, this is a young tree and it's really small. But check this out. Whoa, when it grows up, it's gonna be really big like that tree. Wow, I love trees. They're so great for our planet. All right, let's see here. All right. Okay, first thing we need to do is find a great place for our fern. Let's see, how about right here? All right, here we go. All right, so what I'm doing is making sure I dig a hole that's about two times the size of 
the fern's pot. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. That looks real good. <laughs> All right. Hey, I'm about to get really messy, so let me put on my gloves. I probably could have put the gloves on before I used the shovel, but that's okay. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Let's take this fern. Are you ready to be in your new home, fern? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna be very careful and flip it upside down. Shake it. There we go. And then I'm gonna place it nice and gently right here and put the soil back. There we go. See how I'm putting the soil all around the edges and the sides? Perfect. Wow, and I'm breaking up all the big clumps. Wow, this fern is gonna grow up to be really big and strong. Perfect. Let's scoop up a few scoops of mulch. Put it in our little planter bucket. And what we're gonna do is put this on top of the soil, all around the fern. There we go. Perfect, wow, let's get a few more scoops. Wow, this is awesome, good job. I love planting plants. Like I said, it's really good for our planet to be able to plant plants. <laughs> and since this is a native plant, like I said earlier, it's gonna thrive around here. But hey, what else do we need to do? Yeah, we need to water it. All right, ooh, here we go. All right, here we go. Here you go, woohoo! There we go. That's a good amount of water for now, but since it's a native plant, yeah, the rain around here is gonna provide a lot of water, so we don't have to come out here every day to water it. <laughs> Let's put these two plants around here. <sighs> so then, it looks nice and pretty. Wow, how does it look? <laughs> yeah, I think it looks so good, we should probably take some photos. All right, I have a fun game. First, we're gonna act like three different things. Seed, stem, and flower. Ready? First, act like a seed. Oh, get nice and small. <laughs> now act like a stem. <laughs> and now act like a flower. Yeah! All right, here we go. Yeah! Seed, stem, Seed, stem, flower, stem, seed, flower. The last step on our great green adventure, check. We gave our new friends soil, water, and sunlight that they needed to grow big and strong. And more plants is always great for the earth. Great job, <laughs> yay! Woo! <laughs> have you had fun today? Yeah, I sure have had a lot of fun with you as well. Yeah, we found a lot of puzzle pieces. Whoa, I love puzzles. They're so challenging. <laughs> hey, let's go over the four puzzle pieces that we found today. Puzzle piece number one taught us to clean up and recycle. Cleaning up and recycling helps things to grow and gets rid of pollution and that's really healthy for our Earth. Puzzle piece number two took us to oh Sparky and taught us about electric cars. Remember, they use electricity instead of gas and that's good for the environment because they don't create as much pollution. Plus, he was such a cute little car, beep beep. Puzzle piece number three was all those little tiny seeds. Remember them? We visited the different plants at the nursery and even learned how those tiny seeds grow to become adult plants and flowers that give our air some clean oxygen. And finally, puzzle piece number four taught us what our plants need to grow big and strong. When there are more plants in the world, 
there are more homes for animals, more food to enjoy, and cleaner air for us to breathe. <sighs> Great job. Okay, I have an idea. Why don't I try and put all these puzzle pieces together and see what it looks like? Huh, there's two. All right, there's three. Wow, we have four puzzle pieces all put together. Hey, what shape is this? Yeah, it's a circle. Whoa, and look at what we made. Yeah, a puzzle of our planet Earth. Hey, and all four of these things on these Puzzle pieces are just a few ways that we can make our planet a healthier, happier place. Whoa! I love our planet Earth, and I love you. Thank you so much for being my friend, and thank you so much for helping me, Blippi, make our planet a happier and healthier place. Woo! Walking through the forest, look at all the trees. They give us lots of air, what we need to breathe. Look at all the critters roaming on the ground. They help carry the seeds to grow plants all around. Flowers are blooming, making lots of food for all the bugs and creatures, even me and you. We're singing the earth song. to recycle paper, glass, and plastic Taking care of the earth will make you feel fantastic You can plant a tree or pick up some trash Ask a friend for help Then it'll be a blast We're singing the earth song We're helping the planet Together, together We can make a change Song. Come learn all about it Together, together It's time we start Let's do our part Let's do our part Let's do our part <laughs> Hey! It's me, Blippi! And it's almost autumn, which means it's almost time to go back to school. <laughs> I love school so much because you get to learn a lot of new things and spend time with your friends. <sighs> I'm so excited for school. <laughs> yeah. Look at what it is. It's a school bus. <laughs> Whoa. And the door's open. <laughs> Whoa. Let's go. I wonder if anyone's gonna get off the bus. Ooh. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hello. Oh, Lippy, can you find these stuff that I need right here? Yeah. Whoa. Is this your school supply list? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll do it. Thanks so much. Okay, bye. Bye-bye. Did you hear that? Yeah. My friend Kevin, he gave me his school supply list. Hey, school supply list, why don't we go on a school supply scavenger hunt? And we find everything we need to start school. <laughs> Check out our school supply list. Looks like we'll need the following things to get ready for the new school year. A backpack, some crayons, 
and the book. Let's go find a backpack. Wait a minute. What if we use the school bus to get to all the places we need to go to find our school supplies? <laughs> yeah. Whoa. And check it out. It's a really big wheel. <laughs> and tire. <laughs> yeah. These are really big. Keep the school bus safe on the road. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, look, there's a person. Hmm. Hello, Hi. I'm Blippi. What's your name? Naomi, the school bus driver. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Naomi. Well, we've been going on a school supply scavenger hunt, trying to find everything we need to start school. Can you help us out? I sure can. Would you <laughs> like to hop on? Yeah, I would love to. <laughs> okay, let's hop on the school bus. Come on. This bus is so big! <laughs> and there are so many cool seats! Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! And seat belts! <laughs> Make sure you always wear your seat belt if you're in a bus or a car. <laughs> They're really important. Whoa! Now look at this over here! Whoa! Naomi, what's this? This is the door handle to open the door. Whoa! Can I try it? Sure can. Okay! <laughs> So, how do you open the door with this? You lift this up, and then you open it, and you close it, like that. Okay, let's give it a try. <laughs> Push up with your thumb, open the door, and close the door, and open the door. <laughs> okay, I think I've opened the door enough. <laughs> hey, we should get started on our school supply scavenger hunt. Naomi, do you think you could help us find a place to get a backpack? Sure, sit down and buckle up and we'll go. Okay, I'm so excited. Here we go. Gotta buckle up first though. <laughs> oh, buckle up. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. So fun riding on a school bus. Well, it looks like we stopped. Hey, that looks like a great place where we could get a backpack. <laughs> Thanks, Naomi. Anytime, Blippi. Whoa, look at where we're at. <laughs> Mokuyobi in South Pasadena, California. <laughs> and they make really colorful backpacks. Hey, maybe today you and I can learn about how to make a backpack and get a backpack of our own for our school supply scavenger hunt. Oh, this is gonna be so much fun. Come on. Whoa, this place is amazing and really colorful. <laughs> Whoa, hello. <laughs> <laughs> so silly. There are so many beautiful things here. And look at this wall. Whoa! <laughs> there are so many bags. Hey, maybe we can find a backpack for our school supply scavenger hunt. <laughs> yeah. There are bags like fanny packs. Yeah. We have green and yellow and the color blue. <laughs> Whoa! And we have a beautiful backpack. <laughs> yeah, this backpack is all different colors. It has some really cool pink pockets with magnets and zippers. <laughs> they sound so cool. Really good for storing everything you need for school. <laughs> Whoa, or we could do this. We gotta put the backpack where we found it. Okay. <laughs> A mega backpack. <laughs> well, look at it. It's so colorful. It's purple and green and peach. <laughs> this backpack is 
a little too big for me though. I'm gonna put it back. That was a really big backpack. <laughs> Whoa, hey, maybe this will be better. A mini backpack. <laughs> this one's really pretty. It's the color yellow. <laughs> hey look, there's a person over there. Maybe they can help us find a backpack. Hello, I'm Blippi, what's your name? Hi Blippi, I'm Julie. <laughs> nice to meet you, Julie. I'm the founder and creative director of Mokuyobi. Whoa, Mokuyobi. Hmm. Julie, what does that mean? It means Thursday in Japanese. Whoa, and why is your store named Mokuyobi? Because Thursday is the best day of the week. <laughs> Whoa, it sounds like if Thursdays is fun, if this place is colorful, <laughs> then it's gonna be really good. <laughs> hey, we've been looking for a backpack getting back to school. You think you could help me find one? Yeah, that's perfect. We have tons of colorful backpacks. <laughs> okay, let's find a backpack. And you think you could show us how you make one? I would love to. Come <laughs> on over here. Okay, here we go. Whoa, and look at it. There are so many tools. Do you use these to make a backpack? Yes, these are all of the tools that I use to make what I do. Whoa. I have seam rippers. Whoa, look at that. It's a seam ripper. Yeah, and is this to take thread out? It is. Whoa, <laughs> this is cool. And scissors? Yeah, I know scissors. Make sure if you're using scissors, ask a grown up for some help. And then this is the tool I use to cut out fabric. Whoa, it's a rotary blade. Whoa, look at this. It's a rotary blade. <laughs> kind of looks like a pizza cutter. <laughs> you want me to show you how I use it? Yeah, could you? Whoa. Whoa just like a slice of pizza. <laughs> that is so cool, Julie. And so you use all these tools to make a backpack. Well, what's the first step to make a backpack like this? So first I have a pattern. And a pattern are all the pieces that need to be cut out in fabric oh, that cool. go into making the backpack. That's so neat. So first you make a pattern out of paper. And then you take the paper and you trace it with the rotary blade? Mm-hmm, that's correct. <laughs> and then I cut it out and it looks just like this. <laughs> Whoa! What part of the backpack is that? This is the strap. Whoa! Yeah, look at it. <laughs> and then you just sew it together. That's right. And these are all the pieces that go into making this bag. Whoa! Backpacks are so amazing. Look at all the different pieces you need to make a backpack. <laughs> that looks really complicated. Woo! <laughs> Hmm. Hey, Julie, do you think you could help me find a backpack for my school supply scavenger hunt? Yeah, I'd love to. Let's go look for one. Okay. <laughs> hey, you can help me pick out one, too. Hmm. So many, and they're so colorful. Whoa. <laughs> How about this one? It's my two favorite colors. Blue and orange. <laughs> and it has some other cool colors, too. Yeah. <laughs> Julie. I like this backpack. That's a great choice. Do you want to pick out a patch and I'll sew it on for you? A patch? Yeah, that would be so fun. Hey, let's pick out a really fun, colorful patch. Whoa. So, hmm, which one will look the best on my backpack? We have, ooh, <laughs> this one has a planet. Whoa, <laughs> galaxy patch. <laughs> Maybe not this patch. Let's see. Whoa. Maybe we could put a piano on my backpack. <laughs> Maybe not this. <gasps> Wait, I have a good idea. We were looking for a backpack, so we should do this one. <laughs> we should put a backpack on my backpack. <laughs> so silly. Ooh, Julie. I found the patch I want. That's perfect. Will you help us sew it on the backpack? I'd love to. Okay, here you go. Julie's gonna help us sew on the patch. Ooh, I'm so excited to see her at work. <laughs> there you go. Look at this. It's a really amazing sewing machine. <laughs> Whoa. 
Julie, what is this right here? So this is the thread I'm gonna use to sew it on and it's invisible. Whoa, invisible thread. <laughs> That's really handy. So when we have our patch on, you don't see any other colors, just the patch. <laughs> exactly. Okay, <laughs> this is so exciting. <laughs> Our backpack is going to be beautiful! <laughs> oh. I'm going to put it right here. Ooh. How does that look? I think that looks great. Perfect. <laughs> and the best thing to do while you're waiting is dance! <laughs> Time to dance like a sewing machine! together. And look, Julie did an amazing job with my backpack patch on my backpack. <laughs> oh, we did it. We got a backpack for our school supply scavenger hunt. <laughs> That's great. Here's a sticker. <laughs> great. We can use this sticker to mark that we got a backpack. <laughs> well, thanks so much for helping us, Julie. Bye-bye. Thanks so much. Come back soon. Okay. Oh, that was so amazing. Well, looks like we gotta go off to our next stop. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Whoa! I'm so glad we got this awesome backpack. Hmm. Let's see what else we need for our school supply scavenger hunt. Hmm. First thing on our school supply scavenger hunt, check. A backpack is a really important school supply because that's how we carry all of our other supplies to school. Let's go find more supplies to fill it up. Hmm. Naomi, can you think of a place where I can find books and crayons? Yes, I know just the place. <laughs> okay, great. Better buckle back up. <laughs> this scavenger hunt is so much fun! <laughs> Whoa! We made it here to the school! <laughs> Thanks, Naomi! No problem, Yippee! <laughs> Whoa! Look at where we're at! Young Minds Preschool in Los Angeles, California. I'm sure we'll be able to find the last two things on our list here. Come on! <laughs> hey! Wow, I am so excited to be here at a school. <laughs> so cool. And there's a person. <laughs> Let's go say hello. Hello! Hi, I'm Miss Maya, the teacher. Hi, Miss Maya. I'm Whoopi. Oh, and Miss Maya is the teacher. <laughs> Whoa, what's your favorite part about being a teacher? Well, my favorite part about being a teacher is helping kids develop their imagination. Whoa, I love my imagination. Imagination is amazing. You can imagine all kinds of things, like being a dinosaur. Rawr, rawr, rawr. <laughs> or you could imagine being underwater. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> so many fish. <laughs> it's so silly. <laughs> well, Miss Maya, what are some of the fun things you do in preschool? Well, at preschool, we like to play in sensory bins and develop our sensory motor skills. Come on over. Oh, I like to do that. <laughs> Uh-oh, Miss Maya, I have my backpack. Should I put this somewhere? Before we do this, come on over here. Oh. Look, let's find your cubby. There are so many cubbies. Hmm. Can you see which cubby I should put my backpack in? Hmm, there's a lot of names. Felix? Hmm, that's not my name. Whoa, <laughs> Bella. 
That's not my name either. Oh, <laughs> wait! This one is orange and blue and says B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Blippi! <laughs> that should be my cubby. Okay. <laughs> okay, Miss Maya, I think we're ready to do some fun things. <laughs> Over here we have our sensory bins. Look at it. It's a sensory bin. There are all kinds of winter Arctic animals. <laughs> Whoa. Do you know what kind of animal this is? <laughs> yeah. This right here is a penguin. And it's the color white and black. Whoa. And it has yellow and orange on its cheeks. <laughs> oh, penguins like to play in the snow. Woo. <laughs> Whoa. And there's a lot of snow. Woo. <laughs> it's snowing. <laughs> Whoa. These are really fun sensory bins. The snow feels so soft. Hmm. And messy. <laughs> Whoa. And these are little glass pebbles. They're marbles. Whoa. And rocks, too. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> really, really hard. And really, really soft. Whoa, this is cool. Hey, do you see any other animals? I see a couple. It's a seal. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Can you make a sound a seal makes? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Seals are so cute. <laughs> well, this has been really fun playing in the sensory bin. The soft part, it's snow. And the rough part with the rocks and glass pebbles. <laughs> Miss Maya, are there other fun things you can do in preschool? Come over here, Blippi. Another thing you get to do at preschool is paint. Come check out oh. easel. Whoa, look at it. Painting is the most fun ever. <laughs> we can paint anything we want. Hey, we can use our imagination. <laughs> just like Miss Maya told us. And we can paint anything. Hmm, but first, don't wanna get too messy. I'm gonna wear this little apron. Make sure it's tied on nice and tight with the bow. I think we got it. That was a little tricky. <laughs> okay, whoa, let's think of something to paint. Hmm, we have four colors. Blue, yellow, <laughs> the color red, <laughs> and green. <laughs> hmm, what should we paint that has those four colors? Hmm, oh, let's paint a flower. Yeah, a really pretty flower with a stem and a leaf. Hmm, okay, let's start with Start with some yellow. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna put the paint on my brush and paint a petal. One. <laughs> Whoa! It's so fun to paint and move the paint around with your brush. <laughs> one petal and put another one over here. Hmm. And another one here. Whoa, we have one, two, three petals. <laughs> I think we can put a couple more on this flower. Let's put on another one, four petals, and <gasps> five petals. Whoa, whoa, this flower looks beautiful. <laughs> and let's put some red for the inside of the flower. Whoa! <laughs> Looking really pretty. Hmm. So we have petals inside of the flower. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> let's put on the stem and some pretty leaves. So we'll put a stem, just a line. 
Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! And a little leaf. <laughs> Whoa! Hmm. Wow, our flower's looking really pretty, but we forgot to use blue. Hmm. Let's make a sky. <laughs> Here we go. Whoa! Can use lots of paint and the sky is really fun because you can make a mistake you can just paint however you want in circles or side to side or up and down whoa okay hmm. whoa <laughs> hmm. hey wait a minute let's paint one last thing we'll put a little bird flying in the sky one bird <laughs> and we'll do another one hmm. Whoa. uh oh i made a mistake <laughs> that's not a bird hmm that's a circle but that's okay sometimes you make mistakes but you can turn your mistake to something beautiful hmm. let's make this little mistake into a beautiful red <laughs> yeah, we're gonna make a, a balloon on a little string. <laughs> oh, painting was so much fun! <laughs> Thanks so much, Miss Maya. Mm, but I am looking for a couple things to add to my school supply list. I've been looking for crayons. Can you help me find some crayons? I think I can. Let's look over oh. here. Will these do? <gasps> Miss Maya, they're so colorful and they're huge. <laughs> Whoa! I think I'll take an orange crayon and a blue crayon. <laughs> Let's go put these in our backpack. Wait a minute, <laughs> I forgot something. Hmm, I'm still wearing my apron. So silly. Take off our apron first. Hmm. Here we go. We'll keep this near the paint. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> and we'll put our crayons in our backpack. <laughs> okay, let's look at our school supply scavenger hunt list. We have a backpack and Crayons! Hmm. Wait, Lippy, don't forget your sticker. Oh, thank you, Miss Maya. <laughs> Second item on our school supply scavenger hunt, check. Crayons are such a cool school supply. They help us color and bring our imagination to life. Let's go find the last supply, a book. We're gonna keep looking to find the book and finish our scavenger hunt. Oof, but that reminds me. After all of that painting and dancing and having a lot of fun, I'm getting a little hungry. <laughs> I think we should go eat lunch. <laughs> I'll see you at the table. <laughs> hey, whoa, look at where we are. <laughs> it's the lunch table. And look at what I have. Really colorful lunch box. <laughs> I can't wait to eat what's inside. I'm so hungry after all this scavenger hunt. <laughs> Let's open it up, see what's inside. Whoa, look at it. We have apple slices, apple juice, and a really tasty looking sandwich. <laughs> Ooh, let's try an apple. <laughs> Yum! <laughs> that is so tasty. I love apples. <laughs> mm. Mm. They're so sweet and they're really crunchy. <laughs> and look, the outside of the apple is the color red, <laughs> but the inside it's the color white. Whoa! Oh, and look, 
a really tasty sandwich. <laughs> I can't wait to take a bite. <laughs> Whoa, that sandwich was so tasty. I'm gonna take another bite. I love eating lunch. But my mouth is really dry after eating all of that food. So I think I should have a little drink of apple juice. <laughs> oh, a straw? Whoa! And it's a bendy straw. Oh, oh. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> Apple juice is so tasty! <laughs> and sweet. <laughs> well, this was so much fun eating lunch with you, but we need to get back to the school supply scavenger hunt. We found crayons and we found a backpack. <laughs> but we still need to look for a book, so keep your eye out. Hey! We're at a school. Maybe this school has a library. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna pack up my lunch and we can go explore. Whoa! Whoa! Look at this place. <laughs> it's a library. Whoa! And there's a person over there. <laughs> I bet they're the librarian. <laughs> Let's go ask. Fun. Hi. Hi. My name's Flippy. What's your name? I'm Miss Jessica. <laughs> Hi, Miss Jessica. I have a question for you. Okay. Are you the librarian? I am. <gasps> oh, that's amazing. Um, but what does a librarian do? So a librarian collects books and then we organize them by categories. Oh, well, that's perfect. We've been going on a school supply scavenger hunt, and we found everything we needed, but are still looking for a book. Okay. Could you help us find one? I sure can. What are you into? Hmm. What kind of book should we pick out? Hmm. Well, we want a book that's really fun and has a really good story. Are you into construction? Yeah, I love construction. You can build things, <laughs> and it's so cool to see all of the vehicles. <gasps> oh, that would be the best. Maybe we can find a story about construction vehicles. <laughs> I have the best book. Do you like excavators? <gasps> Do I love excavators? I love excavators. <laughs> they are so cool. <laughs> The excavator book. Oh, so cool, right? That would be perfect. Okay, this is how this works. Okay. I have a ticket and I need to write your name. Okay. Can you spell it for me? <laughs> I sure can. Okay, ready. Okay, all ready to spell my name. Will you help me out? B L I P P I. <laughs> would be. So, you're going to borrow this book. I'm going to give you this ticket. Today is Monday, and you have to return it on Wednesday. Oh, okay. Can you do that? Yeah. And it's yours. There you go. Oh, wow. I am so excited. We're borrowing the book from the library. So when we borrow it, we'll get to read it. And then when we're all done reading it, we can bring it back so someone else can read it. <laughs> wow. And it looks like we have the final piece of our school supply scavenger hunt puzzle. <laughs> we have a backpack and crayons, and now we have a book. <laughs> Don't forget your star. Ooh. Thank you, Miss Jessica. You're welcome. <laughs> I'll see you later. See you later, bye. bye. Enjoy the book. I am so excited to start reading my new book. Come on, let's read it together. The final school supply, check. With our book, crayons, and backpack, we are definitely ready for a brand new school year. Whoa! That was so much fun visiting the library and borrowing a book. <laughs> well, the best part of borrowing a book is getting to read it. <laughs> yeah! We get to read the excavator book and 
find out what the story is about. <laughs> okay, let's see what the story is. Once upon a time, there was an excavator. <laughs> yeah, this excavator was really big. The biggest in the entire town. <laughs> Every day, this excavator would wake up <laughs> and do its favorite thing in the entire world. Can you guess what this excavator liked to do every day? <laughs> yeah, it loved to dig. <laughs> yeah, it dug everywhere. It dug really deep and made huge holes and really big piles of sand. <laughs> and one day, while the excavator was digging, it hit something really hard. Oh no, said the excavator. I wonder what I hit. <laughs> and as the excavator kept on digging, it realized that it had reached buried treasure. Whoa, <gasps> treasure, <laughs> said the excavator. I love treasure. Let's see what kind of treasure it is. So the excavator opened up the treasure chest and found it was filled with jewels. All the townspeople were so excited that the excavator had found jewels that they all cheered. <laughs> the end. <laughs> that was such a fun story. Thanks for listening with me. Well, that was fun reading, but now we get to play. And look at where we are. We're at the construction zone. <laughs> and we get to dig ourselves. Okay. It's time to dig. <laughs> Whoa, look at all these things. First, we need to get geared up. <laughs> we have a hard hat. Yeah, this will protect my head. And a safety vest. Whoa, <laughs> uh-oh, it's a little too small. <laughs> so silly. Well, I'll just hang it up. The hard hat will keep me safe. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. Shovels. And, oh, whoa, do you see what it is? It's a wheelbarrow. <laughs> Let's do some digging. Whew. <laughs> that was hard work. Wheelbarrows are so cool because you can carry the dirt wherever you want. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Look at me go! Whoa! 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 <laughs> uh oh! <laughs> All the dirt fell out of the wheelbarrow. <laughs> That's okay. Do you see what I see? <laughs> yeah! It's a mini excavator. <laughs> wow, digging so much fun. <laughs> well, thanks for listening to my story and having so much fun playing in the construction zone. <laughs> I'll see you back on the bus. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Whoa, that was so much fun learning all about preschool. Well, time to get back on the bus. <laughs> now that we got our book and our crayon, we can head back. <laughs> Thanks, Naomi. You're welcome. Buckle up. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> We're all ready to go now. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Here we go. Wow! That was 
was so much fun finding all the school supplies on Kevin's list. <laughs> yeah, we found everything. A book, a backpack, and crayons. <laughs> yeah, oh, I'm so excited for the school season. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? Okay. B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you real soon. <laughs>